Tommy Shelby is a reserved, introverted character, yet he exudes a strong charisma. While it's not advisable to emulate Tommy in every aspect, there are five habits you can adopt from him to gain more respect from those around you. But, before we start Tommy's first habit, I want to know in the comments if you want to receive more content like this. Just say, Tommy, and I will create more videos like this one. 1. Slow Movements Tommy's movements are unhurried and composed. When he's not in physical combat, he seldom appears rushed. This calm demeanor, reminiscent of a stoic mindset, conveys a sense of control and being above intimidation. Tommy's unhurried and composed movements are not just a physical characteristic, but also a reflection of a deeper, mental discipline. In Stoicism, there is a strong emphasis on maintaining inner peace and rationality regardless of external circumstances. Tommy, in this regard, embodies the Stoic ideal of apathia, or freedom from destructive emotions. By not allowing emotions to overtake him, he maintains a clear mind and a steady hand in all situations. Furthermore, his ability to remain undisturbed in the face of chaos or threat reflects another stoic principle, the understanding that we cannot control external events, only our reactions to them. Tommy's composure is a testament to his mastery over his responses. He doesn't allow the actions of others to disrupt his inner equilibrium. This approach to life, as demonstrated by Tommy, can be incredibly powerful. In our own lives, adopting a stoic attitude towards challenges can help us remain calm and focused. It teaches us that by controlling our reactions, we gain power over situations that, on the surface, may seem beyond our control. Tommy's ability to stay calm and composed also aids in his decision-making. Stoicism teaches that decisions should be made from a place of reason and objectivity, not impulsiveness or emotional turmoil. By maintaining his composure, Tommy is able to assess situations more accurately and make decisions that are in line with his long-term goals and values. This is a key aspect of Stoic philosophy, aligning actions with a rational and virtuous life. In essence, the calm demeanor of Tommy Shelby is more than just a physical trait, it is a reflection of a well-disciplined mind, embodying key aspects of Stoic philosophy. His character serves as a reminder that by cultivating inner peace and rationality, we can face life's challenges with greater clarity and strength. 2. Eye Contact Another trait of Tommy is his ability to maintain eye contact, even in confrontational situations. This shows confidence, a key stoic virtue. However, it's important to balance this holding eye contact can escalate tension. The stoic approach would be to use eye contact to convey confidence, not aggression. Tommy's steady gaze, particularly in confrontational scenarios, is more than a display of confidence, it embodies the stoic principle of facing challenges head-on, yet with a balanced and measured approach. In Stoicism, the emphasis is on maintaining equanimity and rationality, even in the face of adversity. By holding eye contact, Tommy demonstrates an unflinching willingness to confront issues, a hallmark of stoic resilience. However, Stoicism also teaches the importance of temperance and understanding the impact of our actions on others. In this context, maintaining eye contact should be about establishing a connection and understanding, not about intimidation or provocation. This aligns with the Stoic belief in acting with virtue and reason, rather than letting passions or impulses dictate our behavior. Moreover, Tommy's use of eye contact reflects the stoic concept of prosoke, or mindful attention. By maintaining eye contact, he is fully present in the moment, engaging actively with the situation at hand. This level of attentiveness allows for a deeper understanding of the other person in the situation, enabling a more thoughtful and effective response. In our own interactions, adopting a similar approach can be beneficial. 
using eye contact as a tool for engagement rather than confrontation allows for better communication and understanding. It's about finding that balance, as Stoicism suggests, where we can assert ourselves confidently without crossing into aggression. 3. Be non-reactive. Tommy's ability to remain composed in the face of hostility is a hallmark of Stoic philosophy. His non-reactivity under pressure exudes confidence. Stoicism teaches us to control our reactions to external events, something Tommy exemplifies well. Tommy's capacity to stay composed, especially when confronted with hostility, is not merely a sign of personal fortitude but also resonates deeply with the Stoic understanding of indifference to external stimuli. Stoicism doesn't advocate for a lack of response, but rather for a considered, rational reaction that is in alignment with one's inner virtues and values. In essence, it's about responding, not reacting. In the face of hostility, Tommy displays what Stoics refer to as ataraxia, a state of serene calmness. This tranquility under duress is achieved not by ignoring the hostility or denying its existence, but by understanding that his control lies in his response, not in the external provocation. By doing so, he retains power over his internal state, embodying the stoic ideal that our peace of mind should not be at the mercy of external events or the actions of others. Moreover, Tommy's non-reactive nature in tense situations also demonstrates the stoic concept of a more fatty or love of fate. This philosophy encourages the embracing of all life's experiences, good or bad, as necessary parts of the whole. Tommy's acceptance of challenging situations without undue emotional upheaval is a testament to this principle. He takes things as they come, focusing on his ability to handle them rather than wishing for them to be different. This stoic approach to life's adversities is something we can all aspire to in our daily lives. By cultivating a mindset that views challenges as opportunities for growth and learning, and by keeping our responses aligned with our inner values, we too can navigate life with a greater sense of calm and effectiveness. 4. Show conviction with your words. Tommy's deliberate choice of words, using decisive language such as I will, instead of tentative phrases like I hope to, aligns closely with Stoic philosophy. In Stoicism, there is a strong emphasis on clarity of thought and purposeful action. By speaking with certainty, Tommy is not just expressing confidence in his plans, he is also practicing the Stoic virtue of being direct and truthful in communication. This Stoic alignment in language reflects a deeper understanding that words have power and should be used to convey truth and intent clearly. Stoics believe in the concept of logos, or rational discourse. By articulating his intentions with conviction, Tommy is embodying this principle, showing that he is guided by reason and purpose rather than by whims or uncertainties. Furthermore, this assertive communication style also represents another Stoic concept, the commitment to one's own agency and the understanding of what is within one's control. When Tommy says I will, he is asserting his agency, focusing on actions he can directly influence. This is a key Stoic teaching, to concentrate on our sphere of influence and act with intention within that realm. In our own lives, adopting a similar Stoic approach in communication can be highly effective. By speaking with conviction and clarity, we not only communicate our intentions more effectively but also reinforce our own commitment to our plans and goals. It helps in aligning our words with our actions, a crucial aspect of living a stoic life. 5. Stick Motivation Tommy's method of employing carrot and stick motivation is an astute strategy that reflects a deep understanding of human nature, resonating with Stoic wisdom. It's about comprehending what drives people and using that knowledge judiciously. In a Stoic sense, this approach is not manipulative but aligns with the virtue of practical wisdom, known as phronesis in Stoicism. 
It involves using insight and understanding to navigate interpersonal dynamics effectively. When applying this to scenarios like seeking a promotion, it's about engaging in rational negotiation and planning, key aspects of stoic thought. By discussing with your boss what they require for a promotion, you demonstrate a stoic's approach to problem solving, clear, objective, and focused on mutual benefit. Delivering on these expectations while preparing for alternative outcomes exemplifies another stoic virtue, that of adaptability and preparedness. It's about recognizing what is in your control, acting on it, and being ready for different eventualities. Furthermore, this carrot and stick method also ties into the stoic practice of seeing the world as it is, not as we wish it to be. By understanding and leveraging realistic incentives, the carrot, and consequences, the stick, you're operating within the realm of reality, a key stoic principle. This pragmatic approach is about navigating the world effectively, using rational judgment and foresight. In our lives, employing a similar strategy means understanding the dynamics at play and acting in a way that is both effective and aligned with our values. It's about recognizing the different motivations of people and finding a path that aligns with their desires and our objectives, all within the framework of rational and ethical conduct. This video, like Stoicism, is about understanding the power of one's presence, words, and actions, and using this understanding to navigate life more effectively and respectfully. If you like this video, please like and subscribe to Stoic today. See you next time.